hi <laughs> that's just so weird like welcome back i don't know what else to say like not that anyone is probably going to be watching this but if you do and if you are hi um if you don't know me my name's logan um i'm pretty sure no one can watch this so i haven't been on youtube for like a long time because i actually moved to new york and i live with like i live with my roommate nicole and she is awesome i met her on an app which is like the weirdest thing i know everyone is like that's kind of weird um yeah it is kind of weird but um she's cool me and nicole are like best friends for like sisters um a lot of people literally ask us if we're twins we literally just have blonde hair and like we don't have the same color eyes but um sorry about the lighting it's really 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 sunny out today today's the first day since summer in new york that it's been like over 60 degrees so everyone no one really knows how to act in new york when it's hot um especially since like COVID and everything so anyway I'm just gonna kind of like explain today like why I moved here and like how I did it so after I graduated high school I went to college for a year in like where I'm from and I I had an okay time I hated the school part I have always like not really liked school I just kind of like skated my way by especially like senior year of high school I that's my cat also by the way he's his name is Billy but um yeah he's kind of crazy anyway I like skated my way by in high school so I just kind of like kind of winged it in college and like I hated it so all in all I pretty much failed all of my classes I was going to transfer and then I was like you know what I'm just going to go back home for right now good thing because um anyway the school that I was going to was basically like you can't come back for two years because I failed like all my classes and I don't care like I just hated school like all the time so anyway I moved back home in May 2019 and September 2019 I started modeling I already looked into modeling and I was like um I, t I like took headshots anything blah, blah 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 i took headshots in atlanta september 2019 and then covid hit and obviously no one did anything no one left their house it was kind of like a weird time at first everyone was just kind of like what the fuck and so i literally didn't leave my house for like three months i think so then april 2020 last year after like during quarantine like middle of quarantine kind of I get an email from like a modeling agency in New York saying that they wanted to like work with me and like sorry I keep saying like wanted to work with me and wanted to represent me so I kept emailing her like back and forth we set up like um a date to like do a photo shoot and me and just kind of go over everything and that was in April and then in June anyway this is Billy Billy say hello In June 2020, I came to New York to do a photo shoot and I loved it here. And so I was, I had to move here basically. So I was like, I have to move here. I can't live anywhere else. So I started looking into like apartments here and looking at apartments in New York is like one of the hardest things I've ever had to do, which sounds a little bit dramatic, but it is. Um, because eight million people live on a island that's like five miles long and so it's kind of crazy so i moved here in august like august 1st or 2nd actually and how i get here is absolutely whack because i was really stressed out because we were we had to have like our security deposit and our first month's rent on a printed out like check of not a personal check like 
I don't even know what it's called, honestly, like cashier check. And so I made, or like somehow it got confused and it was made out to the wrong person. Then my roommate texted me and she's like, it's literally made out, ours are made out to the wrong person or just mine or something. And I was like, oh my God. So my dad had to drive all the way to Atlanta, which is like an hour and a half away or an hour away from where I lived. And he gave me the new check and my flight was at 12.30 and this was like at 12 and I was, I was gonna miss my flight basically. And I was already like really stressed out and I already hate planes, like hate planes. So I go get not on a plane, let's just say, okay? So I didn't get on a plane and I missed my flight and I was like, you know, I was like bawling, crying. Like my mom was take, my mom was like driving me and she was like freak, like she was stressed out too. So she was like crying and I was like, this literally sucks. So <laughs> there was no more flights that day except like five hour flights. And I was like, I absolutely cannot get on a flight for five hours. I can barely like, sit on a plane for two hours like an hour and a half maybe I think that's how long it takes to get to Atlanta from New York and um so my mom and I took a train for 17 hours from Atlanta to New York and it was the worst decision I've probably ever made and I took a train one more time home and then after that I was like Forget this, I'm literally going on a plane every time. So that's how I got to New York and now I'm here and this is my room. Welcome to my crib. Um, we've had a little bit of hiccups um, <laughs> about this apartment. Yeah, never mind. I'm not gonna get into that. But all in all, it's a really nice apartment. Um, never in a million years would I ever pay this much for anywhere else in America, let's just say that. So it's not cheap. Um, everything else, like food, groceries, clothes, everything is higher priced. But that's how I got here and I am, so I model here, that's why I moved here. And I love it here. And I also like babysit a kid, <laughs> like, so that's how I make my money and live here. But yeah that's pretty much it thanks for watching um there's gonna be more videos hopefully i'm really bad at like filming and ignore my room this is not how i would like prefer to decorate my room but this um beautiful painting picture whatever you want to call it was found off the side of the road and so was this little um cow print stool i was I'm sitting on so in New York there's a thing called stooping I'm kind of like just rambling now but um people find like leave stuff on the side of the road and you just kind of like pick it up our couch was like $20 off of like Facebook marketplace our bar cart was free um but uh, my roommate got like a ton of free stuff in her room we have like a thing under our tv and it's off the side of the street. Like a lot of things are off the side of the street, but they're nice, they're like good quality. So anyway, thanks for watching. There's gonna be more videos to come. Um, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time, bye.